Hey everybody, it's Ryan, and uh, what I have here is pretty dang cool. This is a knife, I guess you could do scissors, but it's a sharpening three-way, actually four, four-way uh, whetstone. And I just got this. The company reached out to me and said, Ryan, can you do a review and really show how this works? It's kind of hard to get across in pictures. Who am I to say no? But no way whatsoever this being provided to me affects this review because I'm just here to keep it real. What all do you get with this uh, with this kit? And so it's by the company Do Walks, I believe. And it comes with one, two, three, four pieces. So you have uh, this leather, um, I think it's kind of like a burring strap or whatever. Basically, this is just kind of um, is used to, when you're sharpening, to kind of get the, the, the fine edges off when you're, you're finished uh, sharpening. You have the base that it goes in, looks like this. You have three sides to the sharpening stone. You have a 400 grit, a uh, 1000 grit, and then a 8000 grit side. So you can start more from a rough side and then kind of go smooth. And then if you're like super, super, super dull, then you also have this kind of starting um, section here where you can kind of, it's like a built-in V to kind of get the V uh, going, get you some edges basically cut. So I'm gonna change the camera, show you how this really works. All right, so what I have here, I just have it sitting on top of just a, a cutting board, just from an example standpoint, this is not included. And so you have your base and it's really a kind of a heavy base. It's got um, like a rubber on the bottom of it. So depending on the, you know, on the, the surface that you're sitting on, it's not gonna move around. And then you have your three different sides. So this is a 400 side, uh, but this is not a very sharp knife, you know? So I'm gonna use some very light paper, just to give an example. I'm sawing this thing and it's not cutting. I'm basically, I'm sawing with the weight of my hand. It's not cutting. This would be considered a dull knife. It's, it's I mean, it's got a little edge to it, but it's pretty dull. So uh, what I'm gonna do first thing is I'm gonna pull this per the instructions about five times. I mean, this thing is maybe 10 times because this is like super dull. All right, so then what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a 400 grit side. So I can kind of feel it. You can kind of see it has sort of this octagonal pattern on it. It says this is a wet stone, so I'm gonna put some water on this just to get it wet, just to kind of help with these, the uh, um, get the edge on it. And then you have this piece of equipment here that kind of helps you get an angle. So you have a 17 degree, a 14 degree, and a 20 degree uh, as far as how sharp you want this. And so what you can do is you can start with the 14 degree and then kind of, I'm sorry, you could start with maybe the 20 degree and then work up to the 14 degree, which was gonna give you the, the sharpest. And just so from an example standpoint, what you would do is you would hold the blade up to this so it's flush with this, so you're, you're like this, and then you're gonna kind of pull it and give yourself an edge. And so in this example, we're just gonna start here, laying it flat against this. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, and five. Then we're gonna switch sides. One, two, three, four, five. So that was at 20. We're gonna keep it going. Let me get a little wetter here. That's, set, that's now at 17. I'm pull that. Again, I'm laying it flat. Two, three, four, five. So I'm gonna turn it around. 17. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna go down to 14. So 14 is gonna give us the, the, the deepest edge on it. Now, I don't know if this is, I'm not like a knife connoisseur, but to me, uh, this is what you would do to develop an edge. Again, this is on the 400 grit side of the whetstone. All right, and then I'm gonna kind of get, per the instructions, let me get kind of the edge off now it's starting to feel a little sharp. So then what you would do is then you would migrate up to the 1000 side, which is this side. So it's a little bit smoother as far as getting there. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five. 
One, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to go over to the 8,000 side, which is gonna be almost like a white color. Again, we're gonna get it wet. Go to 14. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I get the edge off. It's definitely sharper, definitely sharper. You can see it cut, <laughs> cutting right through it compared to what it was before. So from an ease of use, uh, this thing's pretty easy. The instructions are very easy to understand. And if you might be wondering like, how is this uh, constructed? What all is involved? So the, each three sides um, are made of are diamond sharpening stone. So there is there is sort of a premium material. The 400 has a coarse diamond coarse. The 1000 is more of a medium diamond coarse. And then the 800 is a ceramic. And so that's a little bit different, ceramic fine grit. So that's going to allow you to really kind of get this as, as sharp as you need your blade. Again, this is an extremely dull blade that you can now get to, um, you know, as sharp as you might want to get. So if you're looking for something to get your blade sharp, and you can use this on scissors or pretty much any metal, I would assume. Um, hopefully this answers any question you might have, and we'll talk to you soon.